Phoenix here and welcome back to a brand new video. So in this video today guys, uh, I'm going to be talking about how to get your first 500 subs on YouTube. Now the reason to why I want to make this video is because I've actually wanted to make it for a while, but just haven't got around to it because there's been other videos and stuff that I've wanted to make. So yeah, so basically yeah guys, today I'm going to be talking about how to get your first 500 subscribers on YouTube. So you see guys, uh, I've got 637 subscribers. And uh, I actually gained all those by just doing a couple of simple things which I'll be talking about in this video. So yeah, let's get to the first point and that is to talk about trending topics. And now this is quite an obvious one as to how I got 500 subs was because I talked about trending topics. One of the first trending topics that I ended up talking about was the whole Leafy is here disappearing situation. I actually made that video and it got over 50,000 views which then boosted up my sub count to around 400 subs. So yeah, it got around to about 400 subs, and then from then on out, you know, I just started to make more videos on trending topics, you know, like Grade A Under A disappearing and that sort of stuff, and so yeah, and basically that got me kicked off, and basically that got me over 500 subscribers, so yeah, basically that simple. And so now let's talk about the next thing, and that is to upload consistently, and now by this, what I mean is to upload every couple of days if you can, you know, or if you're just someone that wants to upload it weekly, then by all means upload weekly but I don't know about monthly though if you're only able to upload monthly then yeah sure go for that I mean it works for iDubs he ends up getting millions of views per video uh, more views than what PewDiePie would get averagely and you see PewDiePie has more subscribers but yeah so if you're someone that can only upload monthly then I guess uploading consistently could work for you but you know I do recommend uploading every couple of days as that's what's what that's what I do you see uh, I upload every couple of days and the reason to that is because if there are days when I don't upload right say for example I don't upload for a week instead of gaining subscribers I'm just going to be losing subscribers you know that's what happens you know like if you're someone that uploads say every two to three days like me but then there are days when you don't upload for like five days you know your viewers are going to think like oh why haven't they uploaded you know like you know, I'm just going to unsub, and I know that's a stupid mindset to have, but that's just what some viewers have, you know, like, oh, they haven't uploaded in a couple of days, so I'm just going to unsubscribe, you know, or if you're someone that uploads weekly, it's going to be more like, oh, they haven't uploaded this week, you know, I'm just going to unsubscribe. I know, like I said, it's a bad mindset to have, but that's what they do, you know, that's what some viewers do. Not all of them do it, but some do it. So yeah, if you want to maintain your subscribers and keep your subscriber growth steady, just upload consistently as it will help. And now my next point is to try it, keep your subscribers active. Now you see guys, YouTube isn't all just about subscribers, you know, views are one of the main things too, you know, if you've got like say a thousand subs, but you're only getting like five views per video, you know, that's nothing special to think about, you know, like only five of your viewers are staying active. And you see guys, uh, YouTube at the moment is kind of broken as some of you would probably know. So views are kind of low at the moment. So if you're someone with like, like around 100 subs and you're only getting a few views per video, you know, don't worry. You know, everyone, you know, is kind of suffering at the moment who has a small channel. I mean, some bigger channels are even, you know, complaining about YouTube being broken and the views not really working and stuff. I mean, some of my vid videos aren't even getting proper views that they should have, you know, like one of my most recent videos only has nine views, when in reality that would have gotten like around 40 to 50 views. But yeah, like I said, YouTube's broken, people aren't really getting notifications and that sort of stuff, so yeah. And so basically, uh, back to my point, you know, what I want to make is to keep your viewers active. Now, the reason for this is because all those inactive users you know, they're probably going to be thinking like, wait, why am I subscribed to this channel? You know, I don't even watch them. You want to keep them watching so then they know, you know, who you are and remember why they subscribe to you. You know, you want to keep them, you know, there, you know, like some of my viewers, you know, watch my videos, you know, like, like I said, you know, before YouTube, you know, started kind of messing up on the views and stuff, you see like, Say, for example, if I had like 400 subs, right, back when I had around 400 subs, I was getting around 50 views per video, and that is pretty average, so yeah, uh, if you've got like 200 subs, you know, and you're keeping 200 viewers active, you know, then great, I don't know how you do it, but great, you know, because you can't keep all your subscribers active, you see, you know, only around like 25% of your subs are going to stay active, so yeah, uh, do not worry if that is what ends up happening, you know, and you're only keeping around 25% active, because still that's enough, you know, because not every everyone's going to stay active. I mean, look at PewDiePie, 69 million subscribers. He's almost at 70 million. He probably is by now as of making this video, you know, but like he only gets around three to six million views per video. You know, if it's a trending topic, gets around 20 million. So yeah, you know, don't worry if 
most of your viewers do not stay active, you know, it's not really your fault particularly, I mean, it probably will be, you know, that's why you got to upload consistently as well, back to my upload consistently point, you know, you've got to upload consistently, you know, so then you can keep them viewers active, so then they don't end up unsubbing, you know, because that's one of the worst threats when it comes to YouTube is, you know, uh, people unsubbing, especially when you have a smaller channel, so yeah, and now onto my next point. So now my next point is to try not sub for sub. Now, why not sub for sub? You know, that seems like a quick method. Well, you see, it may feel great at first because I've had previous YouTube channels, right, that I've ended up deleting and stuff where I would do sub for sub, like this one channel that I used to have called Halo Veteran TV. You know, like I used to have that channel, right? And basically on that channel, you know, I made like Halo Easter egg videos and stuff. And so basically, right, uh, on that channel, you know, I was like, oh, I really want to get subscribers. You know, how am I going to get subs? And, you know, I ended up subbing for subbing. And, you know, it felt great at first, you know, like oh whoa now I've got 44 subscribers but then that's when I felt like oh this is just cheating you know I felt like crap because I was subbing for subbing and you know it's not good to do so basically do not sub for sub you know it may get you to 500 subs it may not but at the end of the day it's going to make you feel bad because you're not getting the subscribers legitimately you see so yeah you know you're not going to really feel great and, you know, it's just going to make you feel terrible overall. Like, I could ramble on for maybe even an hour, you know, just talking about how bad I felt, you know, for subbing, for subbing. You know, it feels like you're almost buying subscribers or you're cheating, you know, so do not sub for sub. I warn you all to not sub for sub. All right, so now to my next point, and that is to not get burnt out. Now, what I mean by this is and this kind of correlates with, you know, uploading consistently, you know, like I said in that point, you know, like, uh, if you're someone that can only upload weekly, then upload weekly, you know, don't try to push yourself to upload every few days, and the reason for this is because otherwise you will get burnt out, and if you get burnt out, you won't want to make videos, so you might not make videos for a while, and this is a mistake that I've made before, you see, like, I've gotten burnt out many times, in fact, I've kind of been going through burnout at the moment on YouTube, there are days when I don't want to upload, but I still end up uploading anyway, you know, so yeah, you know, and it's not really good because you're not motivated, you know, and it's not really going to keep everything interesting, so yeah, and basically, you know, you just want to kind of not get burnt out, you know, so then you can upload more, so then you won't lose subs, you know, so then they won't, you know, like, think like, oh, they mustn't be uploading anymore, you know, and just start on subbing, you know, you do not want that at all, so yeah, and so anyways, guys, um, I know this is probably a, uh, quite a, what's the word that I'm searching for, um, subtle way to end the video, I guess, you know, I, I know that this is a subtle way to end the video, but uh, I'm just going to end the video here because those are all the points that I have on to how you can earn 500 subscribers on YouTube. I know this is kind of different from the other types of videos I make. Uh, I just want to really make this video, you know, to kind of help people out that kind of want to reach 500 subs. So yeah, I might make a video later on down the road on how to reach 4,000 hours of watch time. So if you do want to watch that, then yeah, be sure to. And so anyways, guys, uh, that is the end of this video. If you did enjoy, do not forget to like and subscribe. You see on this channel mainly I upload commentary videos and sometimes Halo videos as well. And also lately I've been talking about the possibility of me making a second channel. I actually talked about that in a video quite recently, uh, a few days ago. And if you haven't watched that video and you're already subscribed, be sure to because... Uh, it hasn't got many views and I don't think many of you even though it existed, you know, I don't even think notifications would have went out, you know, only nine people saw it, which is pretty unusual, you know, like I think I mentioned on earlier in the video, you know, that video should have gotten around 40 to 50 views. But it only ended up getting nine views, you know, because you see YouTube is broken at the moment, as most of you would know. So, yeah. And so, anyways, guys, uh, again, thank you all for watching this video on how to get 500 subs on YouTube. There are a few more points that I did want to make. But you see, guys, I think you already get it. You know, you just got to get out there and you got to have fun as well. You know, I guess I could also say that. Have fun with the videos you're making. You know, do not, like, uh, just make videos that you don't want to make. You know, and also make, you know, kind of trendy style videos. So say, for example, you know, commentary videos are trending, you know, then make commentary videos. If vlogs are trending, then I guess make vlogs. I mean, I would never make a vlog. I mean, I just, 
I'm not that type of person, you know, to really make a vlog, but, you know, if they're trending and you kind of want to do that, then do that. You know, if gaming videos are trending, then do gaming videos. You know, whatever's trending, just stick to it, and also make sure you have fun with it as well. Just don't do something that you just want to do, you know, for views and subs. Make sure you also do it because you have fun doing it. And so yeah guys, uh, that is the end of this video. If you did enjoy, don't forget to like and subscribe. And also if you do end up reaching 500 subscribers because of the tips that I've made here, then be sure to tell me. And yeah, I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye guys.